Adrian donated fifty dollars and said, "I'm a condensed matter physicist." Bruh, why are you watching this show, Gordon Freeman? <laughs> uh, and it frustrates me that people are just going to assume science will come up with some invention to save everybody. I hate to say it, but it doesn't look like we'll be able to fix the issue. Yeah. Uh, well, based in black pilled. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm, fecal matter. Mm. Well, the good news is, guys. Um, there is some science that's happening. I wanted to show you guys this. This is the Arby's Meat Mountain that we preserved in epoxy. What do you call this? Yeah. Resin. Resin, resin. Can you find out when we actually um, took the holy dip? And so this is the Meat Mountain from Arby's. It has chicken, bacon, uh, uh, roast beef, cheese, and it's an abomination of against against God. In yeah. fact, that rabbit, I feel it's sacrilege to have the rabbit so close to the meat mountain. Murder animal! It's like it's like a black hole of animal slaughter. It will suck in the rabbit I think the, and add him to die. the meat mountain. <laughs> I think the the current uh, wildfires and climate change is actually punishment <laughs> from God for for this. Well, it, you know, the meat mountain is is doesn't help. Yeah. It does not help at all. No. And yet here it is. It is in perfect condition, one year strong. This thing is perfectly preserved. Wow. And it's solid. My question, and maybe that particle physicist can answer. Mm. You know. Adrian, let us know. Um, you know, people are always finding these, like, preserved amber with prehistoric bugs and shit that's, like, hundreds of millions of years old. Can this resin last that long because i would love for future societies to dig this up and just ask what the fuck it's bro? Alive! can you imagine that they're taking dna samples from this and being like trying to recreate our culture from this shit like an right. jurassic park type exactly scenario? yeah once all of the uh once we're in the post-apocalyptic wasteland and all these animals are extinct and civilizations being rebuilt 200 years from now they'll be able to to clone a nice little farm mm -hmm. for chickens and cows and pigs. Yeah. That, that, what's important is that it, it, what this is is a, the rosetta stone of fast food <laughs> in the future they will be able to have another's meat mountain if they play their cards right mad max meat mountain mm -hmm. yes sir you know, so this this to me is very important. This is a relic of of who we are. You know how they have like that seed uh, somewhere in like uh, a seed vault. Yeah, yeah, in the Iceland, I think. Like an I in a frozen tundra, they have underground a seed vault where they have every seed um, in this library. My seed is it's, all over this place. Fuck, that is such a gross soundbite, dude. Is he really <laughs> saying what I think he is saying? Yeah. Do you think it will rot in the resin, A.B.? I'm saying that, yeah, anywhere bacteria could grow. Um, but there's food. no oxygen. It could still reach, I'm guessing. And I'm looking right here, it says some foods will rot quicker, like strawberries, but... Yo, this thing has not changed appearance in a year, dude. If there was bacteria in here, it would have got it by now. Is there a way we could clean off the resin and you could eat it? I was thinking about that. <laughs> I was, that was another thought I had. When we first did that, I, I asked that to Sam, and she's like, nah, that'll, that'll probably kill you. Because yeah. the resin itself, yeah, toxic. But um, <laughs> somebody but, said the meat mountain will definitely outlast us. No worries. Oh either. yeah, your legacy will live on. That's right. But um, don't you think it? It's like it hasn't decomposed at all, and it's been a year. Incredible. Yeah, I don't know. Incredible. This website says food will decompose, but a body won't. Well, how would they know that? What? I don't know. That's a weird thing to assert. Yeah. What's the name of that website? Necrophilia.org? SalvageSecrets.com. Oh, that's the one I'm on, too. What is this website? <laughs> okay. Glad you said that. You got a lot of info. Anyway, there. I just want to give a shout out. And of course, you know who did this. Sam. Who's always yeah. uh, producing these incredible uh, wonders. So, stand up, Sam. She's not here. She's not here. She's not here. Sit, who's sit, Sam? Sit, sit down. 